Pelicans and Salem Red Sox on Saturday, but we actually go back to Friday for this first part, game four of the series. Here is a ground ball in the top of the first inning for a run. RBI single by Austinson Garcia. And then later on in the second for Salem, RBI ground out Albert Feliz. Salem goes up 2-0. Rain came down, so this game will be pushed to Saturday. And Pedro Ramirez gets an RBI hit by pitch in the Pelicans half of the fourth to get on the board. Pelicans still trailing, and here's Andy Gariola with a double play as the tying run comes in, and the Pelicans tie it 2-2. Ismael Mena smacks a double into right center field in the bottom half of the sixth inning. He brings home a run, and the Pelicans take the lead, but that would not be for long as Salem scores two here in the top of the eighth. But Pedro Ramirez once again, a two-run home run in the bottom of the eighth. The Pelicans take a 7-5 lead in a tie ball game. And Myrtle Beach would go on to win Friday's suspended game, 7-5. In the seven-inning game following, it's Pedro Ramirez again. Bottom half of the second, an RBI triple to right center field. Myrtle Beach starts off with a 1-0 lead. In the bottom of the third, Moises Ballesteros rips an RBI double up the first baseline. Myrtle Beach 2-0, and then Felix Stevens right behind him with an RBI single into right. Ballesteros scores, and the Pelicans took a 3-0 lead. In the top of the fourth, Salem got on the board with an RBI single by Ender Solira. Birds still hold on to a two-run lead as Salem scores one more. Back in the bottom of the fourth, Juan Mora with an RBI single into center field. Pelicans back up by two, and then Parker Chavers, two outs here in the sixth, brings home one more. Pelicans lead by three, and that's how the game would end. Five to two, the final Myrtle Beach sweeps on Saturday.